Warning, this is a pest control video and it will show pests being controlled with air rifles. If this is likely to offend you, then please stop watching now. For the rest of you who like these type of videos, let's get on with the action. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pontypool Pest Control. In today's video, I'm going to be returning to the dairy farm. As this farm is so big and has a lot going on, there is plenty of free food and water on display. The rats seem to love it here, and they're always moving in rent free, but the sheriff is back once again handing out some eviction notices. Just a little rat info. Did you know that a female rat can ump up to 500 times in 6 hours? I bet that's why they like peanut butter, they must be using it as lube. When a young rat turns 4 or 5 weeks old they also start to breed. They reckon 2 rats can turn into 1200 in a year. I would love to find these places and move them out free of charge. Tonight I'm going to be using the FX Impact Mark 1 in 177 calibre. My pellet choice is the Mako Slugs 10.5 grains and the scope is the Pad 008 LRF. I'm also going to be using an added IR, the KL52 Plus. This gives better image quality than the standard IR and the battery on the pad lasts hours longer. That's enough talking, let's go and hand out some eviction notices. They seem to be quite shy tonight peeping from behind the curtain to see how big the audience is. This is Ronald's first time on stage, so please give him a warm welcome. What a fantastic display. I only wish I had more work for him. After all, the sheriff is here to clean up and these two were so kind to wait for me by the brush, so I didn't waste any time and I swept them both off their feet. Another one soon shows up, but I run out of ammo, and the car was 5 minutes away. The only thing I had on me was Viagra, but it seemed to have worked the treat, and it stiffened him right up. Five hundred times in six hours, it must be true. This one seems to be doing his own work before starting some action. Maybe his friend from earlier could lend him an hand. He's stiff as a post. Next time you see a rat dragging a dead one, don't think the rat wants a meal. There's only one thing he's planning on eating. Even though he's dead, he just can't help himself. He gotta slide it in there. Hee-haw, cowboy! Every time the word gets out that the sheriff's in town, nobody wants to run and hide. Look at this one having a wash and getting ready to be on the new episode. Congratulations, the sheriff just made you famous.
no matter how hard I try and how much I would like to hit them all. Even the sheriff misses from time to time. So if you're out hunting and you're missing a few, don't get disappointed because everyone does it. Shooting is all about timing and patience. Never take a shot just because you can, and always be 110% before firing the shot. People always talk about how slow I shoot, and they say I could shoot a lot faster and shoot more. No, I could injure a lot more and let them suffer. Respect what you wish to hunt, and don't be mean, kill them clean. I am really impressed with the slugs. They are expensive, but if you wanted to kill things clean, they do give their extra punch and stop things in their tracks. I am new to the slug world, and I have a lot of tests that I would still like to do. Sadly, it's that time again. We have come to the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you're new to the channel, then you should consider subscribing, not to miss out on any of my upcoming videos. I would like to thank each and every one of you that's made it this far. It really means a lot to me, and I appreciate your support. I have recently started a Facebook page. There's 550 members so far, and it's growing by the day. So if you fancy a private chat, or sharing some pictures or videos, please feel free to join. As always, I look forward to chatting to you all down in the comments. Thanks for watching, keep safe, all the best, Pontypool Pest Control, aka The Sheriff.